Hey, that ain't Mike could do it better. I ain't tripping off all that shit. What's going on? What's going on, man? It's Richard Play TV, man. We back at the Royal Peacock each and every Sunday, man. I got one of my guys here. We did an interview before, but stuff happened, so we had to do it again. So we're going to do it again. We're going to do it better. Shit, let my fans know, let my people know who you are. Go by the name of Kyrie D. I'm proud of G. And, uh, yeah, like you said, um, you know, we come back better, bigger, um, with new blessings, you know, coming our way. You know, just feel good, you know. Happy to hear you. Got some good talent out here tonight. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, you know, we in the Royal Peacock, so we got to talk a little loud, though, because they performed and that it's the finals. You know what I'm saying? You know, my man made it to the finals, man. He put in hard work for it. So um, tell us a little bit about your rapping career and tell us about how you feel about being in the finals today. All right, well, really I was here to support somebody who was in the finals. That was uh, GA Champ. Shout out to him. But I did uh, perform for the first time like a, about, it was about three weeks ago. Yeah, you know, and I made third. Um, and, you know, really that was a, that's something new to me because I don't really like being in competitions like that. You know, uh, I'm just now getting out of here, you know, but I've always been doing music. Music has always been, you know, just part of the whole thing about Kyrie, you know what I'm saying? A.K.A. Slay, you know what I mean? Geek House. So, um, yeah, you know, been rapping since I was 12, you know what I mean? You know, just been performing since I was 9, you know what I mean? So, it's always been there. So, listen, so you said you came into third place, right? You came into third place, am I right? All right, so... When you're dealing with competitions like that, though, you don't always come into the first place. Do that, does that make you want to stop doing what you're doing? Or do they give you some type of sense of urgency to make you want to grind harder and smarter for it? Really, you shouldn't even think about none of that. You should be coming in, like, just wanting to perform and, like, have some fun on the stage because really you can do that shit. I mean, you know, to each his own. Like, have you, um, you know, you take about, I mean, how you take a competition. Like, I don't, I don't compete. I don't compete with nobody. You know what I'm saying? Everybody is my peer, but then again, we do compete with each other. You know what I'm saying? But we compete with ourselves. That's the end of conflict, you know, that we have. You know, we compete with life. So we pretty much compete with anything. So I don't even think about that shit. You know what I mean? Like, I just, I just fuck with the music. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just me. Yeah. So, you know, we in season three right now, though. So in season four, are you going to come back stronger and better and harder so you can be that number one person? Have you been making music for that? Or you just been laid back and taking the L's and making the L's into a W, adding another L to it and making it to a W? Is that what you're doing? You're definitely going to see more of me, uh, the different uh, versatile beat elements to my music that you're going to hear, man. You're going to hear a lot of different things. Uh, yeah, you gonna see me again. I'm gonna be here. You know what I mean? I'm definitely gonna come back stronger. Definitely gonna come back harder. The music is, uh, you know, like we talked about earlier. You know, it's a slow grind, and uh, it, it's it's been like it's been it's been cool. it's been like that. You know, for for a minute. So to be continued. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. Um, what is, what is, what do you think you probably went wrong at in the competition? Why do you think you didn't go up number one? Do you think it was that energy? Was it your energy while performing? Was it the song? Or what do you think it was? Like, when you, when, when that happened, did you go back home and, and evaluate your performance and say, well, I might have did this wrong. I might have, I might have moved wrong that way. What do you feel like you did wrong? Uh, my main thing is just like, Remembering the words or whatever, but other than that, I kind of like give it like my all. You know what I'm saying? My mom always told me to do better than my best, so I'm gonna give it my better. I'm gonna give it better than my best. You know, I'm gonna give it my all. Uh, you know, your last performance is your biggest performance, I guess. And you're gonna feel a, you're gonna feel a certain type of way about every performance, whether it was a small performance or a big performance. You always gonna you know, just you really just gotta write it out. To be honest with you, you know what I mean. So uh, I don't. I, I used to take it pretty hard, I guess. You know, but I just always like had the drive to just keep it going. You know what I mean? To ask, you know, to answer the question. So what do you? Been, what have you been working on lately, uh, as far as music-wise, performances, shows, albums, EPs? What you been working on lately? 
I recently have an EP on SoundCloud that's been out for a minute. It's called No Life. Go check it out. Kyrie the Young Prodigy on SoundCloud. But um, really, I'm just making a beat every day. I'm experimenting. Um, you know, I'm holding tracks. You know, I'm creating every day. You know what I'm saying? I'm getting, if I'm not creating every day, then I'm getting some type of inspiration every day. I gotta keep, you know, I can't, you know, I can't be idle. You know, idle hands is the devil's playground. You know, it just doesn't work like that. You know, so, you know, I gotta do things that just, uh, you know, just keep me, just keep me going, keep me striving. So, what do you see yourself five years from now with your music career? Well, I'm about to be 24 in about two, in a week and a half, I guess. Next year, I'm going to be a millionaire. Because um, I already done deemed it, like, so long ago. Uh, I'm going to be in my own lane, you know, doing what I love, be touring. Uh, I'm definitely gonna like uh, re re release like all the uh, old shit that I had. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like just just for the kicks, you know. Cause really, you know, it's a it's a it's a different era that we live in as far as like how we can strive in the business and the industry and like to make money like you know off the content. Finally, you know, it's just you really don't need too much of the traditional ways of going about getting it you know what I mean as long as you got good people along your side you know what I mean and uh, you keep God in your path you, you can make it you up for it and I'm about to be 23 in August so shit I hope I'll be meeting there with you by next year you know I'm going to be 24 too so shit yeah yeah but I ain't rushing the bag though, man. I want the bag to come to me. I ain't trying to rush it. When the bag come, it come for real, for real, no cap. So, man, hey, man, I appreciate you for doing this interview with me again, though, man. We're going to keep up with your career. I'm going to keep up with you. Anything you want to say before we check out of here tonight? Um, not really, man. Many more blessings to come to everybody. Uh, Just get it. Start with the beef, like where I make it sit, you know. Yeah, I co-sign a lot. But it's real. And, you know, we just got to... Just keep it going, you know what I mean? Follow me on Kyrie Kyrie and Prodigy, man. Geek House, yo, slay, yo. Hey, um, I'm gonna be here at the Peacock. Like, that's it. I don't got no big things planning, you know. I'll just go along as I go. Yeah. Well, you know Richard Pay TV, man. We working. You might see us in Atlanta, Mississippi, Alabama, LA, Canada, London. You might see us everywhere though. It is time to go to the 12. Just came up in the yeah. building, man. I'm G's though, but Richard Pay TV, we out.